John Hanson. Yeah, dinner's just starting to get underway, so we're going to see fewer people, more people moving into that room. Right now, we have ABC 7's Jesse Kirsch with us. Congratulations for your nominations this Thank evening. Thank you. Pretty exciting. Good evening. Yeah. yeah. It's always great to be here. I'm already seeing a handful of people yeah. that I'm catching up with. It's awesome to be here. Uh, and it feels Oh, go ahead. Sorry. No, I didn't mean to cut you off. No, I, I was just going to say, I think what is really nice about what I'm a part of tonight is it's a group effort. Spot News coverage is something that we put together as a team in breaking news scenario, which are usually some of the toughest times, but I think it's when our newsroom really, really shines. Yeah. So what uh, event were you guys specifically nominated for? Sure, so there was a, uh, a group of lawmen, uh, officers who were uh, serving a warrant, I believe it was, up in Rockford. Oh, yeah. And, you know, you remember, this, yeah. I mean, this made national news, yeah. and I remember our, our network, ABC News, Tom Yamas, was out there with us, so what happened was this shooting happens in Rockford, and the alleged gunman then gets in a car and books it about two, two and a half hours downstate from Rockford. So we chased this scene yeah. to Rockford, and oh then my. I, yeah, and, and then, then turned the right around down. and drove down to Lincoln, Illinois. Yeah, I remember this one. And there was a standoff, and I was out there. I mean, it had already been going on for a while, and I got there, and it probably went on at least another hour, hour and a half, and they shut down the highway. All of the, the traffic was being diverted off of I-55, and you could see a block of police vehicles, probably 30 different state police vehicles off in the distance, and they had us really far back. So, as a journalist, what are you thinking when all of this is going on? Well, first off, I mean, a scenario like that, get it right. Uh, you know, right. It, it's a very sensitive topic, yeah. and I, you know, I even think back to what we were nominated for and won one of our group awards for last year was the Chicago police officer losing his life. Uh, in, in, the, in the line of duty. So, I mean, you, you're, you're trying to express the gravity of the situation yeah. and keep everyone informed because we're also dealing with someone who was allegedly armed and surrounded by police. I mean, there are all different layers to this story and trying to put people on the scene with us there. It's yeah. such a difficult scenario for people who do have been out there because not only are you trying to get the story, inform the public about the immediacy that's going on and how it could affect your roads and schools and all that kind of stuff, you have to be very mindful of law enforcement out there trying to do their job. Oh, yeah, and they had us 300, job. 400 yards yeah. back probably across yeah. the field and it was snowing too I mean it was almost whiteout conditions yeah. by, by the end of it. Yeah. It's not an easy situation. Yeah sure. you said you're here as a digital journalist. Let's explain that term just a little bit. Sure. What that includes because you kind of wear a lot of hats. Yeah. As a I do yeah I was saying I have my feet in every bucket so yeah. uh, I, I am tasked with and this has been for almost three years now that I've been at Channel 7 here in Chicago is picking the finding the best way to convey a story uh, whether that's on a digital platform on a television platform on both and then how do we take the the same material and rework it for all those different platforms and actually we just uh, talked with the Cronkite School out at Arizona State University about this because this has turned into a company-wide project called the Community Journalist Program uh, which, which has people placed at every one of our eight own TV stations doing similar work and really trying to break the rules and experiment and innovate. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Well, okay. Congratulations Thank on the you. nominations. Thank you. Wish Thank you the you best of luck here. tonight. Have some fun. Go eat some dinner. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no kidding. We're going to keep all this fun going. Let's get it over to John Hanson. John, what's up?